Hi, so this is Nitin Dahad with the Times and I'm here at CES in Las Vegas. And I'm here with Lando Norris, Formula One driver with McLaren. Yes. Lando, hello, how are you? I'm very good, how are you? Good. So, um, Lando, um, we, we write about technology in our magazine yeah. uh, and, and electronics especially, but yeah. do you have a fascination for technology and electronics or, um, or, or do yes. you just drive? Uh, well, I love just driving, but at the same time, I've, I love technology. It's, I've revolved around it. I've been quite involved in technology and racing and simulators since I was like six or seven years old. Um, so I've grown up with it, obviously. Um, it's a big part of my life. It's a big part of Formula One, which is what I race. Yeah. Um, so without it, uh, well, I don't know what the world would be like without it, but it, yeah, it plays a big part. So it plays a big part. Uh, obviously, you're in an age of digital first, so I yes. think it's kind of natural exactly. to you. Is there any aspect of technology that you think, oh, wow, this really helps me make, do my job prop, you know, much better? Well, yeah, I think one of the biggest um, things which helped me to drive is being able to compare data. So we have uh, live data while we're driving on track, which is relaying back to the engineers and the whole team, which they can then relay back to me, you know, seconds later, um, telling me where I need to go better and where, I need, where I'm not doing good enough, basically. Um, yeah, yeah. So that's what they, they're able to help me with my own driving and every session I'll improve constantly, um, seconds after doing a call. And do you do it on fly? Because I remember you saying that yeah, this is your most favorite button on the radio. on the wheel here, the radio. Yes. So do you do it on the fly while you're driving? Um, yeah. So they can just talk to me whenever they want, but at the same time I can ask whatever I want to as well. So I can just say, you know, where do I need to drive better? Where do I need to go quicker? Um, which corners do I need to focus on? And so on. So that's literally just flicking the toggle down, up and down. When you grew up, did you have a fascination for technology, or it's always driving? Um, I mean, primarily it's been driving, yeah. but I've, I've loved uh, you know, computers still and video games and, and everything like that. It's been a big part of my, um, my career, my path to Formula One. Five years out from now, where yes. do you see motorsport and technology? Well, I think it's going to advance a lot. Um, you know, I don't want it to advance too much that it puts me out of a job and everything's AI. It won't be um, <laughs> Exactly. So I like F1 how it is now. Yeah. I think you, know, you don't want to be advanced. Things will advance, but you don't want to be changing what Formula One is. It still has um, you know, the characteristic of someone, a human being, driving a, a racing car as fast as they can. You don't want anything to be, or anything to be uh, too automated. You know? So everything will improve. Uh, efficiencies will improve. Data will improve. But I still want to be able to drive a, to a racing car yeah. um, in control of you know, brake, throttle, steering, sliding the car around and, and having fun. So, in every aspect, it's going to get better and uh, move forward, but uh, the Formula One and my passion is driving a car as fast as I can, and, um, and that's kind of how it is now. Excellent. Thank you very much, Lando. No problem. Thank you.